guys, welcome back to Baranza's Math Club. Today we'll be learning how to solve literal equations. So literal equations is a topic in which a lot of students suffer because they have a hard time dealing with literal equations. But really, it's a really simple topic if you just take it step by step. So here we have two literal equations, which are ax plus b is equal to c and 2x plus 3y is equal to 6. And for both of these, we're solving for the variable x. When you're solving for a variable, it doesn't necessarily mean you're trying to find the value of that variable. You're just trying to isolate that variable. So what I mean by that is, if you take a look at our first example, we have ax plus b is equal to c. We're trying to find x by itself, so we need to get rid of anything that's happening to the variable x. So here, x is being multiplied by a, and it's being added to b. So we need to get rid of the a and the b. So what I mean by getting rid of it is we have to do inverse operations so that we can move them to the other side. So here we have plus b. The opposite of plus is minus, because the opposite of positive is negative. So we have to do minus b. Remember, whatever you do to one side of an equation, you have to do to the other side. So subtract b on both sides. And we're left with ax is equal to c minus b because the positive b and negative b cancel each other out. So now we have ax is equal to c minus b. Now we have to get rid of the a. a is being multiplied to x, so we have to divide by a because the opposite of multiplication is division. So a and a cancel each other out and we're left with x is equal to c minus b over a. And that's it. We have our solution to the literal equation. So as you can see, we're not trying to find the value of x, we're just trying to isolate it. So x is equal to c minus b over a. Alright, now let's solve the second literal equation. So second literal equation is 2x plus 3y is equal to 6. Remember, we're trying to solve for the variable x, so we need to undo anything that's being done to the variable x. Since 3y is being added to x and 2 is being multiplied to x, we need to get rid of these. So first, let's get rid of the 3y. Since it's a plus 3y, let's do minus 3y, because the opposite of addition is subtraction. Remember to do the same thing on both sides. So plus and mi minus cancel each other out, and we're left with 2x is equal to 6 minus 3y. Next, we have to get rid of the 2. Since it's being multiplied by 2, let's divide by 2. So the 2's cancel each other out, and we're left with x is equal to 6 minus 3y over 2, or if we simplify, let's divide 6 by 2 and minus 3y by 2. 6 by 2 gives us 3. The minus 3 by over 2, a negative divided by positive is always a negative. And 3 divided by 2 will stay as it is. So it would be 3 over 2 and it's 3y. So 3 minus 3y over 2. So this is the simplified answer to our literal equation. So this is how you solve literal equations. And as I said, it's really simple because you're just trying to solve for one variable. And remember, you're not trying to find the value of the variable. You're just trying to isolate that variable. So undo anything that's being done to that variable and you will have your solution. Thanks for watching this video and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye.